Hey guys, I'm just here at Garibaldi Provincial Park at the Rebel Creek Trailhead and today I'm planning to trail run the Helm Creek Traverse which is a 25 kilometer stretch roughly from Rubble Creek Trailhead to Chicamas Lake Trailhead. Now my recommendations uh, would be to have a car on the other side to pick you up. If you're hiking with someone else, you can arrange them to have their vehicle there, um, which would make things a lot easier. Uh, however, today what I'm doing is I'm gonna be trail running the stretch to Chicamas Lake, and then I'm gonna be running back in the same day back to the Rubble Creek Trailhead parking lot. Now my recommendations if you're hiking this, uh, most people do this overnight or multi-day. It's gonna be a big long day for me, so I'm starting here early. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to share the journey with you guys. Um, as I was saying, it's roughly 25 kilometers from Rubble Creek to Chicamas Lake. However, I'm gonna be veering off to Panorama Ridge, which adds a bit of mileage. So it's gonna be roughly 28.5 to 30 kilometers from here to the Chicamas Lake Trailhead. And hope you guys enjoy. Something I wanted to mention when I'm trail running a stretch this long is I always prepare for the scenario if I have to stay overnight. So I at least bring a lightweight sweater, a toque, emergency bivy bag, and a form of emergency communication, that being an in-reach device, because we always gotta prepare for the worst while hoping for the best, of course. This hike starts out with some great terrain to warm up on. It's mostly switchbacks with a really low gradient, so it gives you time to get adjusted to the terrain, which is nice, before it gets to anything steeper. So we're at our first fork in the trail, and you're at the point where you can keep going up to Garibaldi Lake, or you can take a left to Taylor Meadows, and that is the way we are going. Just making way through Taylor Meadows. It opens up to some nice boardwalk for a little bit and a bit of sun. For a short time, I'll back into the trails. You can see your first view of Black Tusk. We're not going there today, but another day. There's a beautiful stretch of boardwalk. You get to run for a little while on the way before the climb up to Panorama Ridge. They got some really well maintained trails. You got your first view of Garibaldi Lake. It's a pretty casual elevation climb, which is nice. Gets to a bit of steeper terrain soon. This is really nice at the moment. Panorama Ridge over there. So we are just at a fork in the road. You can keep going to Helm Creek and down to Chicamas Lake, but we're gonna be heading this way up the ridge to check out Panorama and then descend back down and head past Helm Lake, which you can see in the background and continue on. So I'm just about to send up to Panorama Ridge and there's a giant tarn slash lake behind me. And this may be your last spot to fill up before the last couple kilometers up to Panorama Ridge. It's pretty hot up there. So if you haven't loaded up on water, this is the perfect opportunity. Uh, that being said, if you look in the description of this video, I listed the spots you can get water with the kilometer locations where they exist along the way, which I thought I would share with you guys. So you can uh, check that info. Uh, otherwise, moving on. You can see a really nice view of Black Tusk from the back. You can see the full tusk now. And just below, you got Helm Lake, which after Panorama Ridge, we're gonna be descending back down and crossing through that meadow there. We're 
we're coming up to our first bit of snow. Gets to a bit of a rocky climb here as we're getting closer up the ridge. Getting up to a little bit of snow here. The conditions aren't too bad today. This is mainly just a few spots of snow. Beautiful view. to a little bit of scrambling. here just had a quick snack and headed on the way there's a beautiful view of black tusk so just finished descending panorama ridge and I'm just running by Helm Lake to my left It's a little slow moving going up Panorama Ridge, but well worth the view. It's pretty much a climb all the way up there from the bottom of Rubble Creek. And now it's kind of getting back to some flat ground and it's going to be descending soon to uh, Chicamas Lake. Alpine lakes. The nice thing about the rest of the way down to Chicamas Lake parking lot is it's all a descent. So I believe I got about 10 kilometers to go to the Chicamas parking lot and then ascend back up. But this is a great spot to regain the strength kind of makes up for the slow moving time uh, it takes to go up Panorama Ridge. We're just having a great time here. Beautiful meadows all around. Here is the Helm Creek Campground. Beautiful little spot to camp. This last while has been a pleasure. Nice downhill, really easy going with a mix of flat, well-groomed trails. Just got to Chicamas Lake Campground here, just between six to six and a half hours with breaks and filming. Now, 
My main purpose of this video was filming the traverse up to this point and it was a true 29 kilometers. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'm gonna be headed back the other way and doing it all over again. Definitely feeling it, just having a quick uh, snack, stretching and getting back on the way. I'll have some footage of the suffering on the way back. Otherwise, I hope this video um, was maybe informative for someone who wants to take this route this way. Otherwise, um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and have a good evening. So I'm just making way up to Helm Creek Campground. And right after I got to the bottom and had a quick break, it was a, an immediate climb of elevation. And that was definitely a test of endurance, but making progress, I'm still there. But that last set of hills immediately after oh, it was a challenge. Just past a marathon distance. And I gotta say, this is definitely the toughest marathon I've ever endured. It's definitely been a battle for me with just all the elevation gain. It'll also be the biggest distance I've done in the mountains. I think it's gonna be about 55 kilometers. It's definitely been a mental battle, physical as well, but mostly mental. But just plugging away. Scenery though. Hell Lake, Black Tusk, all that good stuff. I'm actually feeling really good right now. I'm at a point in the trail where it's all downhill or flat. So it's kind of nice. All that hard work has paid off. And uh, just cruising back down. Looking forward to finishing this thing. Hey guys, so I'm back at the car now and that was a hell of a day. I gotta say I'm pretty beat. I really did enjoy the journey, but it's a little repetitive going there then coming back. It's a little mentally draining, but it was definitely good training. It was a total of 53.5 kilometers to Chicamas Lake and back to Rubble Creek parking lot. I hope this video might have been informative to somebody who wants to try going that route. And um, yeah, definitely, definitely feeling it after that one though. Any likes, comments, or subscriptions is greatly appreciated. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Take care.